intercept or a zero or a root is when the y coordinate equals zero. The roots are where the graph intersects the x axis. A quadratic can have zero, one, or two. To solve for your zeros, you substitute zero for y. And then you solve for x. But when you're in standard form, that can't be solved directly. You need some special techniques. The first technique is to factor the quadratic using decomposition or crisscross. Keep in mind some formulas like the difference of squares, cause they can make your factoring much easier. After you factor, just solve the equation for x. The x's are p and q. In a times x minus p times x minus q. That should be your factor for the second technique is completing the square. You can do this when you can't factor. Start in vertex form, that's a times x minus h whole squared plus a. Then x equals plus or minus the square root of negative k over a plus h. But don't forget about plus or formula. It's just a formula you use to solve for x. x equals negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. b squared minus 4ac has a special name. It's called the discriminant. It tells you how many roots that your quadratic happens to have. If it's greater than 